Hello, I'm Angela from Savvy Homemade and today I'm going to make my absolute fave tried and tested night cream. The reason this is a night cream is because of the essential oils I'm using. The frankincense is great for combating wrinkles and it's very relaxing which is perfect for bedtime. The lemon essential oil helps boost circulation and has a brightening effect on shallow skin but citrus oils are not good for sunbathing. So we're about to get started. For a full list of ingredients, go to SavvyHomemade.com. We're going to start by placing a handful of calendula flowers in around 300 grams of boiling water. That's about 10 fluid ounces. Then set it aside to infuse. Once it's cooled to around room temperature, strain the liquid from the flowers to leave a tea coloured liquid. So now we need to wear our wax and oils in a heatproof container. The emulsifying wax stops the water and oils from separating. Bottom line is no emulsifying wax, no cream. Next, avocado and argan oils. Both of these are great for cell renewal and absorb quickly and totally into the skin. So we've got 15 grams each of the emulsifying wax and the avocado oil and 10 grams of the argan oil in our container. In a second heatproof container, pour 60 grams of the calendula infusion. You don't need to waste the rest of it. It can be stored in the fridge for a couple of days and used in another recipe or as a hair or face rinse. Place both containers into a pan of simmering water. Allow the wax to heat through and melt, but don't allow it to boil. The whole process takes around 20 minutes. Once the wax has melted, remove them from the heat and add the water to the oils. Now mix steadily. You can use a spoon or a whisk. If you are using a whisk, try to keep it down to prevent air bubbles. Stir until the cream begins to thicken and has started to have a nice creamy texture. You may find it easier to stir for a minute and let it stand for a minute. Once the cream has started to thicken, it's time to add the preservative. For a face cream, I recommend up to one gram preservative for every 100 grams of cream. This will give the cream a 12 month shelf life, but always make sure you follow the manufacturer's recommended guidelines.
So once you've added the preservative, give it a good stir and make sure it's well combined. Next we want to add the essential oils. Never use fragrance oils as they can cause irritation to the skin and we want the cream to be as natural as possible. I'm adding 15 drops of frankincense and 10 drops of lemon. As I mentioned earlier, these oils are great for combating wrinkles. If you'd like to know more about essential oils, visit SavvyHomemade.com. Give the cream another good stir to make sure everything's totally combined. All we need to do now is spoon into airtight jars and label and date it. So there we have it, a wonderful homemade wrinkle cream. For more homemade crafts and DIY gifts, make sure you visit SavvyHomemade.com. Thanks for watching.